Hey, welcome back. This is part two of our uh, watch along to Hanuman, the 2005 animated film. How about, how, how was part one? No. Great. We haven't watched it yet. I just do these at the beginning so we don't have to stop the movie. Um, <laughs> but uh, if you watch this on YouTube, you'll see a very cut up version of the uh, watch along because copyright reasons. Um, about five to ten minutes in each part. So you can, if you'd like to see the full uncut version, you can head over to Patreon to see our full uncut versions of our reaction there. Uh, I'll put it in the link in the description below and the pinned comment. And uh, let's just get to part three. Madari. Yes, sir? King Dashrat wishes. What is it, sir? To... But, sir, uh, uh, this monkey? Quote your price. That's not what I meant, sir. Uh, uh, I merely... Prince, you must make me a promise. What kind of promise? You must always give him a place in your heart. I promised he'll be my friend, but what do I call him? Hanuman. Hanuman? Oh. <laughs> Ram was wise beyond his years. How could I tell? Well, I too was blessed with divine wisdom. Remember? And as time passed, son of Kesari and Anjani, Come, Hanuman. My brother will be pleased to meet you. Ali, this is my new friend, Hanuman. Hanuman, welcome. Any friend of Sugri... Has the Bali been killed? Oh, no. He blocked the entrance of the cave to make sure Mayavi would never escape. <laughs> in every direction and try. Number one, Nan and Neil. All of you will go south. Anuman, you are a wise and brave warrior. No one can match you in spirit and valor. Will you lead this mission? Oh, divine lady. We're looking for Lady Sita. Please guide us. I shall transport you. Transported to our fast, beautiful blue Somebody ocean. transported him? But there was no road ahead. That wasn't in the other one. It seems like we have reached. How can we go back with nothing? What a yeah. Food. Looks like we're having a feast today. Who are you? I'm some party. God bless you, brother of Chattah. Lord Ram performed his last strikes. <laughs> oh, Hanuman. You may rest on me for a while if you wish. Mighty mountain. I cannot even think of rest. Certainly not before I complete my task. I saw her. A woman race, an ethereal beauty, the Lady Sita. Have you abandoned me, Lord? At that very moment, the demon king Ravan arrived. <clears throat> Sita! When will you rescue me, Ram? Ram! <laughs> Forget him, good! He would have rescued you by now! Hold your tongue, you demon! You insult my husband? You will be punished for this. Huh! You talk of punishing me? The Lord of Lanka? Understand this, you silly woman. If I want, I can force you to be mine. You are making me very angry. If you don't agree to be my wife, I will make the very demons who guard you eat you. Uh, 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 oh, Lord, I can no longer... This ordeal will be over very soon. Your Ram will soon come and rescue you. Finally... One by one, the demons guarding Lady Sita nodded off to sleep. But she was awake. She had a worried look on her kind, angelic face. Akshay Kumar is no more, Your Majesty. No! Poor Akshay. My brave son, it cannot be. It just cannot be. I will kill this monkey myself. 
Father, I will avenge his death. Don't you worry. Go, Maynard. Bring him back to me, dead or alive. Now, Maynard was no ordinary soldier. This son of Ravan was brave, intelligent, and unmatched in his skill with archery. Take this jewel with you, so Lord Ram will know we've met. Oh, I can't wait to see him again. My lady, I'll take your leave now. Sita. Lord, I found Lady Sita imprisoned in Lanka. Hanuman, I shall be grateful to you for the rest of my life. How can I ever thank you for what you've done? Brother, we must leave immediately without any further delay. Yes, Lakshman. Are we ready, Sugri? We are awaiting your orders, my lord. Forgive me, brother, but Lanka would not have burned had you accepted Hanuman's proposal. <laughs> Do not laugh. It's still not too late. Return Lady Sita to Lord Ram with honor and ask his pardon. Never. That cannot happen. You are making a mistake. Lord Ram is no ordinary man. Never, Vibhishan. That can never happen. Do you take me for a coward? There is no one in this universe who can defeat Lord Ram. I've had enough of your cowardice. You dare oppose me? You are not my brother. You are the enemy, a traitor. Get out of my sight. Leave the man now before I kill you myself. Wait, Lord. I'm here. My Lord, I have to obey the laws of nature. If I don't, all creatures living within me shall perish. Tell me, how can I allow that? But my army needs to get across the ocean. You have two fine engineers in your army. Nal and me. Under their supervision, your army can build a bridge across the ocean. They must carve your holy name on the rocks. And then these rocks will float on the water. Very well, then. But what shall I do with this arrow? I cannot requiver it. Release it in the direction of those volcanic mountains. You wish to kill me? Come and get me! Is there a man strong enough in your court to even move my foot? <coughs> Ravan's crown came hurtling towards us. I caught it in midair and laid it at Lord Ram's feet, who then entrusted it to Vibhishan. <laughs> Meanwhile, Angad was making the courtiers of Lanka sweat. <laughs> <laughs> I will do it myself. How ironic. You can fall at my feet, but you're too proud to apologize to Lord Ram. You have had your chance. Now prepare for war. <laughs> that part wasn't There's in there, There's going though. to be war, Sita. Ravan has rejected Lord Ram's final proposal for peace. They're so up to date. Now he needs to go get it. Ignat's weapon has found its mark, my lord. Oh, Lakshman. Lakshman, my brother. <laughs> How could this happen? Hmm? My life is worthless without you, my dear brother. I cannot bear to see you like this, my lord. I shall search the universe for a cure. Go to Lanka and get Sushen, the doctor. To bring a doctor from the enemy camp was no easy task. But I had my own ways. <laughs> Save his life, sir. Please help him. There is only one way that we can save his life. Tell us, Sushen. A magical life-saving herb called Sanjeevani. He must have it before daybreak. 
I'll get it right away. Just tell me where I should go. To the Himalayas. It grows on the Drona mountain. But how will I know which is the Sanjeevani herb? You can't miss it. It glows in the dark. The Himalayas were very, very far away in the north, unknown to me. So I stopped to ask for directions. Excuse me, sir. Is this the way to the Drona mountains? Yes, it is, my son, but you look tired. Uh, there is a pond by the side. Drink some water first. Thank you. That'll be the end of our part two reaction. If you'd like to see the full uncut <laughs> version. Uh, wait, part, did I say part two? I said part two. You did. Okay. Uh, part two reaction. You but can you head over to Patreon you. to see our full uncut, unadulterated versions there. And let's get to part three. Josh!